percentage of murders and murderers and murder victims fit in one MO. You can just take the description of Xerox it and pass it out to all the cops. They are male minorities 15 to 25. That audio of Mike Bloomberg from 2015 in Aspen, Colorado, defending stop and frisk, got the hashtag Bloomberg is racist trending online, with President Trump even calling the former New York mayor racist before quickly deleting the tweet. I didn't understand that back then, the full impact that stops were having on the black and Latino communities. Bloomberg apologized for his support of Stop and Frisk shortly before announcing his run for president. Today, the 77-year-old released a statement reiterating the apology, attacking President Trump as afraid to face him and claiming he worked to reduce Stop and Frisk while mayor. That reduction only came amidst lawsuits and community outcry, led in part by then-activist, now public advocate, Jamani Williams. Don't believe the mic in the commercials. Um, there is a lot of issues. But those commercials, 300 million worth so far, seem to be working. Bloomberg is not even competing in the four early states, but won the small symbolic midnight primaries in Dixville Notch, New Hampshire, with three write-in votes total. Polling shows Democrats, including African-American voters, may be willing to overlook some of Bloomberg's past. And listen to how New York City Councilman Brad Lander, who worked on anti-stop and frisk legislation and supports Elizabeth Warren, talks about Bloomberg. Beating Donald Trump is by so much the most important thing that, that I'm not going to engage in kind of internal criticisms.